WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrial Trade up 159, NASDAQ up 66, S&P's up 13 and a half. Gold, gold contract down $8.80, trading at 2013 an ounce. We have silver down 15 cents, $24, 6 cents an ounce, late sweet crude. Uh, where are you, Lacey? Well, it's only down 91 cents. That was down three bucks. Interesting. 91 cents, $76.86 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10-year note, down three ticks, trading 108.26. The 30-year up seven ticks at 115.27 in King Dollar. King Dollar right now trading up 360 ticks, 103.925. Euro at 108, yen at 149, British pound at 124 to 1 US dollar. Well, you know, when we take a look at the S&P, folks, bottom line, you still got the S&P and the ABC structure up. We're trading right now at a price point. Here we go. Okay, trading it right now at a price point of 454, and it's 462. That's the number. We hit uh, 456 outside, and I suspect what we're going to see here, folks, okay? This is going to get really interesting. You've heard me talk about the day after Thanksgiving before. I think we're going to see a run, the same deal, man. You know, it's going to be an illiquid market. They'll run this thing, and they'll run it. They'll probably run it right up to that 462. We go to the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX. NDX, the three Qs, they're also running up a buck 76 right now. And the, now, it's, it's intriguing here. You know, for the day before Thanksgiving, the Qs got volume in it, man. I mean, they, they got some volume that's basically kicking in. And inside that NDX, we take a look at the strength versus the weakness. You know, kicking it up is uh, eBay up 3%, AMD up 3%, Mercado Libre 2.4, and then we get over to the dollar. So the dollar, bottom line, had a little counter trend bounce today. Couldn't hold price. So when you see this, you know, the dollar got up to this 104, uh, 213. Now you're at 103. Uh, 936 and bottom line that dollar wants down at that 99 level notes and bonds we take a look at notes and bonds they still want higher price which is which is you know what's intriguing is that bloomberg has that yeah rates are going higher it's like i don't know what you're looking at man but the 10-year is only down three ticks okay so the uh, rates are not going higher okay right now it, this is always gets intriguing too about headline news versus looking at the actual instrument you know, we're still at 4.14 on the 10-year. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.